Okay, we switch the server on. Press F12. In the startup menu, we're going to go down and select device configuration. Okay, we're in the Intel RAID menu. We're going to create a RAID value. Go rename it. Choose our RAID level. Go select the two disks using the space bar. And then we're going to click create volume. That's it. The RAID's ready and the OS is ready to be installed. It's worth going into the BIOS, system configuration, SATA configuration and making sure that you've got Radon as the selected boot option. If you've installed Windows Server, it's worth downloading the driver and management software. The management console will give you the current status of your RAID arrays and also let you manage 